Okay, see that uh, big cloud and see that curve in it right there? Sort of, I don't know if that's a storm coming or what, but I'll see if I can show you. For the last like 10 minutes, I'll see if I can get them coming over. There's been tons of these pigeons flying from down south up through here. One group after another. So is that like a really big storm coming? Here comes some more. See them? Really bizarre. So do they know something? I don't know. Why are they all coming? I've never seen them do that. There's Well, today's Monday. Uh, it's going to be a busy three week, three weeks. It'll probably seem like three weeks, three days. Um, Sid and I are going back to the States for uh, uh, a few days. Well, I'm going for a few days. Sid's going and she won't be back until probably sometime in October. Um, this way she gets to spend time with the kids and the grandkids and all that kind of stuff. I have all this fun I have to do, so. Um, but there's a lot going on here in three days. We'll see how it goes. Well, we're missing some people today, uh, but uh, um, one painter didn't show up. I didn't hear from him, so I have no idea. But uh, we started taking down the uh, <coughs> wall with uh, the block, as you saw. And uh, we had a little issue with the jackhammer. We got that resolved. And I pulled one of the painters um, who is going to work on taking the wall apart because I really want that wall taken apart and, you know, 99% put back together or 90% put back together uh, by the time I leave on Thursday uh, because I just, I just, I just want to make sure everything goes okay. So I'm hoping that uh, the power comes back on. Did I mention the power was off? Yeah, it's hard to use the jackhammer or any other electric tools when there's no power. So I told the boys to take an early lunch and I uh, had to drop off some paperwork. And next I'm gonna go grab something to eat and then head back up there. Well, today we start taking apart that wall. Um, I'm thinking it's probably gonna take I'm hoping it's gonna take two days at the most. And then on Wednesday, we can put in the new beam. And that way, by the time I'm gone, uh, this will be pretty much put back together in the shape it's gonna need, pretty much, I said. That's my hope anyway. So, we'll see. Got it blocked off so dust can't go anywhere else. Ooh, look, money back. Don't ask me why, but locally these are called money bats. It's a moth, it's not a bat. Okay, here's today's morning classic. Uh, Whoever these people are who are coming in, uh, they took one of the guy's boats and decided they were going to go out and go paddling and fishing and everything else. Uh, since when, you know, something's just lying around, not being used, oh, it's free for you to use. So like if I left my car and left the keys in it um, and you walked by, oh, I can use your car. So this is going to be an interesting conversation, I think. Kom på, kom på med detta, för att sätta den där jätta bitsen upp i den där pojk. Vad är kaffinet? Det blir lira pisk, ja. Det blir lira pisk.
All right, we've started taking it apart. There's some steel up there, um, but we've got a big jackhammer and a broken smaller hammer, and we really can't use the big one because the big one vibrates this piece that's left too much. So, working on a new plan. this morning but uh, uh, it's all around the clouds out there I don't know if we'll get more it doesn't really matter it's not critical if we do because everybody's pretty much got stuff to do inside or under roofs so it's not an issue short lunch but uh, that's all right I got uh, I gotta get back and see how everything's going like I said I you know I'm the one who <clears throat> ultimately is responsible so I need to make sure everything is staying its course everybody's safe work is getting done and in this case it's that beam that you know <clears throat> they've never done anything I don't think like taking out parts of a building while it's still built so uh, it's really up to me to make sure that <clears throat> everything goes okay okay I still got some the crown molding that's up in here so I can have those guys work on that uh, <clears throat> while I'm gone too and let's see oh, Dennis forgot about that okay I gotta remember that thunder to the north and uh, the uh, where we are no problem so but the power's off so I said okay well I'm gonna run home quick and uh, then I'll see how it goes okay that's Harland over there all right <laughs> Okay, so yesterday we did the, you know, vertical video for Instagram TV, and I put that post up, and I think pretty much everybody agrees. I knew that was going to be the response, but uh, nobody wants to see that on YouTube, and it just cuts everything too short, which is great if you're just filming yourself or some really close-up uh, type scene, but otherwise... You just don't get any landscape to it. You don't get any view out of it. And it, it, it's just nowhere near the same. I mean, it would be like sitting in the front row of a theater with these giant blinders on where you've got the rest of the screen to potentially to see, but there's nothing you can do about it because all you can see is this much. So I'm really not sure what uh, Instagram's thinking is. I mean, I know partly what it is, is that Facebook and Instagram are one and the same. And what they're trying to do is take away market share or viewers from uh, YouTube. But I don't think, I mean, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe the Instagram, um, average Instagram user, uses that in a vertical profile all the time to look at stuff. And now if that's the case, and I'm gonna try it. I mean, I'm gonna put some stuff up on, on Instagram 
on uh, IGTV in the in a in a vertical uh, format, but I'm just playing with it because I can't really see how it's going to be all that great. Maybe I'll be wrong. Maybe for that audience, it will work perfectly fine. Maybe it won't. But for YouTube, uh, unless YouTube changes something drastically, I can't see why that uh, I would change it to a vertical. It's more work for me. I've already got more because I either have to film everything on like a phone or I have to uh, take everything that was horizontal, flip it, and then change the sizing of it. And I really don't need more work. So more work to make a better thing? Yeah. More work to make a worse thing? I don't think so. <laughs>